Qualcomm. At that time, I think I interviewed with Qualcomm, NVIDIA. All of them rejected me for various uh, <laughs> reasons. So my advisor, he, he coached me, I think he said that, see, you, you, you spent like five, six years working on this field. Why don't you try to go into go to Synopsys and see if you can really productize uh, some of your work? And uh, I accepted the offer at Synopsys and uh, that was like a game changer because I can proudly and you know, confidently say it's one of the best engineering companies I've worked at. So one thing I kind of learned at, as, as part of Synopsys is that a lot of people can train models and deploy mo models, right? But how do you debug those outliers? Because those outliers might hold the key for another, you know, 5% or 10% power improvement, right? So that, uh, you know, thing, big learning I had at Synopsys, which I still uh, carry forward. Uh, yeah, so at Synopsys, I worked on both core optimization kind of projects related to, you know, sequential optimization, you know, ground up, uh, rewrote some of the engines, which helped them win benchmarks, uh, uh, incidentally at N NVIDIA, because I, I remember the person who in interviewed me and, you know, immediately rejected me in the, in the first call. She was the lead when I was, uh, you know, on, on the synopsis side. And it was very interesting that, uh, you know, she was using the solutions. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's quite some validation. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> when the person who rejected you becomes a customer, uh, you know, congratulations on Thanks. getting that satisfaction <laughs> of making that happen. Yeah.